calm and content within to do the next right thing that's important you know, and, and, what, and how important is it? You know, my responsibilities of the day, love, loving others and loving myself and feeling warm and content within and to treat others the way I'd like to be treated and talk to others the way I'd like to be spoken to. Yeah, that's, you know, how can I help someone without being so selfish and self-centered, without expecting anything in return? Happy peace of mind, fulfilling my goals for that for the day. Um, yeah. And, and my granddaughter. <laughs> the government, uh, have consideration for other people and their needs, not in your wants. Yeah. Not in your wants. Yeah. Yeah. As I always say, have a bad day, then we can have a good day. Yeah. So bless you with all, all goodness, peace and harmony and happiness to help yourself, to help others. Amen. Send the drone. It's a bit of it. It's fine. Oh, I don't know. Good friend, Ryan. Yeah. yeah. All right. What's the meaning of life? meaning of life is discovering what the journey is about between the bookends of birth and death. That's what I think. And that's a complicated question and it's a hard one to answer. I've tried a number of things um, that a lot of people try, that we think is success. And in, um, in prison after four years, and arriving at a crisis, I discovered that the meaning of life for me is my faith in Jesus Christ. Not religion, yep. not, not churchy stuff, yep. not being good or righteous, but trying to live my life the way I reckon the best human being who ever lived life lived it, following him. Thanks. Being with my kids makes me really happy, watching them flourish, watching them grow. Uh, simple things make me happy increasingly as I get older. Having enough to live, paying my bills, uh, being at peace with myself and with other people and making a positive contribution where I can. Government? Yeah. Well, in relationship to the criminal justice system, which I've been involved in since 1976, I guess I would say that people who make the policies, the politicians in particular, and the bureaucrats, but particularly the politicians, who have the power to change the policies, I'd say, listen to the people that have the truth about the system and how it works and whether it works. Listen to the research because you're going about crime and punishment the wrong way and you're not really addressing the causal factors right. and you're growing a system that's becoming a monster, frankly. Yeah, thank you very much. Okay, pleasure. Um, well, we need to find joy in every moment. Simple as that. Simple. All right. And that's and how you achieve that is a lot more complicated. All right. I like making other people happy. Um, that's what makes me happy. Oh, thanks. And the way I achieve that is by doing surprisingly joyous things for them, um, which is great fun and uh, gives me a little naughty feeling inside when I stage, when I arrange one of those things to happen. And I try and do it so often that I've actually forgotten that I'm actively choosing to do it anymore. Uh, the government, uh, as in ScoMo and his minions, 
Yeah, get the fuck out of politics and go back to mud wrestling or some primeval swamp where you belong. Thank you very much. Welcome. Thanks. Are we in terror? Are we in terror? Yeah, we are in terror. We are in terror. We are in terror. We are in The meaning of life. Um, I don't really think there's a meaning of life, to be honest. I think it's, it's what you make of it. And there's no singular meaning. There's, and meaning isn't really important, to be honest. If you, if you get beyond the idea of having to have meaningfulness, I don't, I don't think there's one singular meaning. I'm not in favour of it. Uh, singing. I like singing too. Singing always gives me endorphins. Hit, probably the biggest hit. I prefer singing than any other activity almost in the world. Uh, release the kids. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Um, 42 is what I've been told by many people. But the unfortunate thing is the answer, the question to the meaning of life is what's 6 times 9, which we all know isn't 42. So, um, unfortunately I'm a bit lost. A guy called Albert Camus once said that the meaning of life was to do what you want, and in his case it was swim on a beach. But then he did write about a character killing someone on a beach, so look, he wasn't, he's probably not the best man to listen to. Mm. Kicking ass and chewing gum, and I'm all out of gum. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, uh, honestly, I don't think they'd understand. Just say it. And they're too busy, you know, trying to hire au pairs and things like that, and dot walk the dogs, and walk the Peter Duttons, and maybe don't do mines. I know you like digging holes. Everyone likes digging holes, but don't dig big ones. Apart from that, maybe, yeah, like David said, think about some kind of other job opportunities. Thanks. You suck! <laughs> Are you going to go back home? Are you going to go back home? Yeah, I'm excited to go back home. Go to the beach. Get a tan. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah. Get big. Big, get big. Yeah. <laughs> the meaning of life is to attempt to enjoy it and to share that enjoyment. Uh, A and B. Me happy yeah, yeah. is uh, yeah, yes. to yeah. make other people happy. Yeah. The government, yeah. oh, go easy on us. Uh, especially Australia, yeah. ridiculous yeah. rules. I can't I actually don't understand. Yeah. I end up in trouble because I simply just do not understand. What I don't understand. Yeah, just let people let people have common sense. Let us exercise common sense. Don't re don't remove that from us. Thank you. Thank you. You can do